All right, so today we're going to be making a video and talking about DIY enclosures. You know, in the tarantula hobby, a lot of the times our only options are expensive acrylic aquariums or exoteria, exoterra um, enclosures that have small screen lids that can potentially cause damage to your tea and are highly hazardous. So basically right now we're going to be taking a fresh and ready bin out of an Energy Star refrigerator and converting this into an arboreal enclosure. So as you just saw, I have sufficient air hose for maximum um, air exchange. We want to make sure that we have cross airflow. That's very important for arboreal setups and just for the basic husbandry of tarantulas. As you see, it comes with this little plastic tray thing that I'm going to use as a false bottom for this bioactive enclosure that I'm going to be setting up here. So this enclosure is really neat too because it opens from the top like that. And so now I've put in a false bottom in and I'm going to use this as a drainage layer, um, I'm going to put gravel on top of it to act like a medium and a barrier for the soil and sand mixture so that the water passes through the soil and sand to the rock underneath the false bottom, which will basically keep the humidity check in this enclosure. So I'm loving the way that it opens. I'm loving the false bottom. Let's get this set up. Start putting in some gravel. And again, this cost me zero dollars. So look for some Energy Star refrigerators when you're out and about doing your daily routine. Okay, so I've put the gravel in and now I'm putting um, the substrate, which is a sand in topsoil mixture. And I'm not going to put too much because, like I said earlier, this is going to be an arboreal setup for an avicularia avicularia. So it doesn't need that much substrate. It won't spend too much time down on the ground. And I love how, how it looks, man. It looks like an expensive display case, man. I like the way it opens. I like how clear the acrylic is on it. I just think that it's a cool little enclosure to actually spend no money on it. Have fully functional in literally less than 30 minutes. So again, so show this um, air circulation holes, cross ventilation, you know, make sure that that's proper. I think I have about 48 to 50 holes drilled into this with a hot um, screwdriver. And I'll go ahead and clean this up with an X-Acto knife. But yeah, and I want to thank you for stopping by and watching my video. I know there's tons of videos that you could be watching. Thank you. And this is the semi-finished product. So basically, you see how much you've saved on an acrylic enclosure or an AMAC box, which is typically very small. Um, the plexiglass and the... And the um, Acrylic tanks are really expensive. I saw one that was over 250 So to be able to have this secure enclosure that's a fresh right or fresh fresh and ready bin out of an Energy Star refrigerator, I think is very efficient and very practical and economical. So, hey, keep your eyes open. You know, with a little bit of imagination and necessity, we come up with anything. Thanks.